Thanks for joining two old guys sitting in their balconies opining on a vintage film from the Vintage Film Channel. Yeah, and uh, by the way, don't be confused by the title Rawhide. This has nothing to do with uh, the TV series that everybody loved. Thankfully. Back in Thank what was the 60s? Thankfully. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So this is a, a, a an old cowboy movie. What's the date of this? Do you remember the year 30, for this? Art? 30, 38, maybe? Yeah, something. Yeah. Anyway, the big draw for this movie is Lou Gehrig. Yes, the real Lou Gehrig. Paying, and he plays himself. Paying, paying Lou Gehrig. Yeah. It's not too much of a stretch for him. He, mm. he was able to do a pretty good job of it. So he plays a cowboy rancher, and um, the big, the second draw is Smith Ballou. Now I never heard of Smith Ballou, but as it turns out, he looks like every Western sidekick I've ever seen in any movie from 1930 to 1990. And and a singing cowboy, no less. <laughs> of course, with a name like Smith Ballou, mm -hmm. you got to have something. Right. Anyway, it's an interesting film. I wouldn't call it a great film, but just to see Lou Gehrig away from the microphone saying, I am I'm, I'm the luckiest, luckiest man and man in the world, the world, and I've got disease I'm going to die from. Just to see him in real life, if you will, and, it was worth it. And, and by the way, as an, as an aside, uh, uh, this was shot, I think, about uh, a year before he uh, announced uh, uh, that he had uh, uh, ALS. Yeah. So uh, he was still looking really uh, uh, healthy. And he came back and he was sure. continuing to play baseball uh, after yeah. this. But uh, this was his one and only film uh, appearance. And, uh, you know, it was, I guess, in the, back in the day, there were from time to time... Uh, uh, probably the most famous uh, uh, person who was not an actor who became an actor was Audie Murphy, uh, but he right. he had a he had a string of movies. He he had a real career as an right. actor. Yeah, right. And in fact, if he, had he not died in a plane crash, he probably would have made another fifteen or twenty play, uh, 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 movies. But this was a one-off, and there were a number of celebrities uh, back in the day. Uh, who did this kind of thing. But Luke Eric was sure. probably the most famous uh, in that period of time. Yeah. And and obviously it didn't go anywhere. I don't recall it getting any awards. Do you, Art? Um, no, they didn't <laughs> have the Razzies in the day. <laughs> anyway, it's a fun film to watch, if for no other reason than to see um, Lou Gehrig live quote in ac in action right uh, but and you know what it's an old cowboy movie they're fun anyway yeah and the sound effects of the of the hoops on the on the dirt paths of the wagons and stuff like that was actually pretty good yeah yeah for an early uh, an early sound film yeah right anyway v watch vintage film channel dot com and uh, youtube slash vintage film channel Gracie's got, among other things like this feature film, she's got old TV shows and everything else you can imagine up there. And they're wonderful. They're wonderful. Uh, if nothing else, use them for trivia contests. Right. They're, 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 they're fun nostalgia. Um, yeah. And uh, every so often, uh, well, we're going to do another one in, uh, next week uh, that's even going to be uh, more interesting because a lot of people heard of it, but most people don't remember it, uh, yeah. the kind of stuff. But one thing we do want to appreciate is the fact that uh, since we started this series, a lot of you have been subscribing. So please tell your friends about it and subscribe yeah, to our YouTube you. channel and uh, yeah. subscribe to the Vintage Film channel, uh, YouTube channel to encourage us to keep doing this kind of things. But it was a lot of fun. We get a lot of fun watching these things. Things we would never have seen if they right. weren't up on the Vintage Film Channel. And just because we're sort of addicted to it now, uh, this is our uh, uh, our addict self-showing <laughs> up of watching Lou Gehrig in his one and only big yeah. screen appearance. Yeah. Uh, well, listen, I, before we go, Art, I want to apologize to everybody. Oh. I want to apologize because I, I get the feeling... As you said, we really enjoy this stuff. Hmm. I get the feeling maybe I'm not being critical enough hmm. 
you know, I mean, this is not a great film, but I still got a kick out of it. So maybe, maybe I should be more critical. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Thanks for, thanks for your opinion. Yeah. I don't want to be critical of your lack of criticism. So anyway, thank you this time until next time and uh, have a great week. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.